Kepler's Law of Planetary Motion Objective To learn about the Kepler's Law of Planetary Motion The planets revolve around the Sun in elliptical orbits. This fact was discovered by the German astronomer Johannes Kepler who proposed the three laws of planetary motion. Kepler's first law or the law of ellipsis states that all planets move in elliptical orbits with the sun at one focus. An ellipse resembles a stretched out circle. The sun is not at the center of the ellipse but at one of its two focal points. The other focal point, marked with a lighter dot, has no physical significance for the orbit. Kepler's second law, or the equal areas law, states that a line that connects a planet to the sun sweeps out equal areas in equal times. When the planet is closer to the sun, it moves faster, sweeping through a longer path in a given time. The planet moves slower when away from the sun. So the same area is swept out in a given time as at larger distances. Kepler's third law, or the law of periods, states that the square of the period of any planet is proportional to the cube of the semi-major axis of its orbit. This law indicates the relation between the time of a planet's orbit and its distance from the Sun. Using this relationship, if we know the duration of a planet's orbit around the Sun, we can find out its average distance from the Sun, or vice versa. P square is equal to A cube where P is the orbital period in Earth years and A is the length of the semi-major axis, which is the average distance from the Sun in astronomical units. Summary Kepler's first law states that all planets move in elliptical orbits with the Sun at one focus. Kepler's second law states that a line connects a planet to the Sun sweeps out equal areas in equal times. Kepler's third law states that the square of the period of any planet is proportional to the cube of the semi-major axis of its orbit.